Welcome to the Thingamajig Scribing Tool. Here at Thingamajig, we promise you that the scribing tool will be your new best mate, saving you time and always getting you an accurate finish. Here is some basic information to help you understand how the scribing tool can make your life easier and your workmanship five star. When fitting the blades to your tool, simply unscrew the grub screw and place the blade onto the blade holder. When retightening the screw, ensure you don't over tighten. This can be done by using the long point of the Allen key provided with the tool. The foot pad cover simply clips on and off. Use this when the scribing tool is being slid along pre-finished surfaces like painted walls, preventing it from marking the surface. Due to its thickness, the foot pad cover alters the measurement of the ruler on the shaft of the tool. You must compensate for this. There is a written reminder of what to do on the top side foot pad. Here a laminated bench top is being fitted to a wall. You will note the imperfections in the wall surface that the bench top is being fitted to. The bench top is placed in the desired position and the biggest gap between the bench top and the wall is located as this is the amount the tool will need to be set to. This can be done with a ruler or by placing the tool against the wall where the largest gap is. Rotate the tool shaft while holding the blade body still until the blade tip touches the edge of the bench top. You'll note the foot pad cover is fitted. In this instance, four millimeters needs to be removed, so the tool will be set to three millimeters to compensate for the foot pad cover thickness. The lock nut is then tightened to lock the blades at the required height. Now simply hold the tool so it is at 90 degrees to the bench top. Move the tool across the wall, applying slight pressure against the blade to commence marking. Continue this process until you are happy you can see the scribed line. Now use an electric planer and trim off the excess bench top to the scribed line, ensuring you don't go past the line. You will notice one of the benefits of the scribing tool is that the laminate does not chip past the scribed line due to the scribing tool blade creating a break in the surface. Now the bench top is replaced to show the perfect fit. Here we see a two-pack painted kick rail front is being fitted to a timber floor. The kicker front is placed on the floor and set in a level position. Again, the blades of the scribing tool are set to the amount required to be cleaned off. The scribing tool is then held at 90 degrees to the kicker front. Slide the tool across the floor to mark the entire length of the path. It is then trimmed to an electric plane. Once again, the paint does not chip past the scribe line due to the scribing tool blade creating a break in the surface. Now the kicker front is replaced to show the perfect fit. Scribing has never been so fast and accurate with a host of features. The scribing tool only needs one hand to operate, provides a flush join when fitting cabinetry, skirting boards and more, scribes internal corners with ease, works on laminate, painted surfaces, soft metals, stone, wood and more. You know you'll appreciate the value of having the thingamajig precision scribing tool. Ordinary screwdrivers all have the same problem. You have to hold the screws. Not anymore. The Works SD driver with automatic screw holder holds the screws for you. Drive screws with one hand. Even above your head or in hard to reach places. Keep up to six bits on board and switch between them with the slide action. It's all powered by a lithium ion battery that stays charged for up to 18 months. Need an extra hand? You've got it. The Works SD driver with automatic screw holder. Get yours today.
The VersaCut by Rockwell lets you change blades one-handed. I like the interchangeable blades the most. I like that I can take and cut any type of material and just change out the saw blade in a matter of seconds. That means you can rip through different materials lickety-split. Its four amps are powerful with a speed of 3,500 RPM, but it doesn't weigh a lot, making it the one to reach for when you are on the move. The Verse Cut is much more lightweight than the circular saw. It weighs about four pounds. It's a lot easier to maneuver around the house. The base plate provides a clear view of where the blade enters the work, making tricky cuts much easier to see. Changing the depth of a cut is right on the side. For around 130 bucks, the saw includes three blades, a vacuum adapter, and a storage bag. And precision. I like the laser beam. I like the fact that if you draw a line, it's not very clear you have the laser beam there to back you up. It makes a nice, smooth cut. VersaCut's laser guide helps you get the right cut every time.